Hello YouTube and welcome to my backyard. It's a sunny but windy day today. The fire is. Uh, I think I'll. I don't. I won't have any problems keeping it uh, going today because of the wind. I don't know if you can hear it, the popping and cracking sounds. I usually just burn birch, but I've got some pine on there today. And today's topic is uh, me restocking tobacco. Uh, a month or so, I ordered uh, tobacco from Black Swan, the UK uh, internet shop. I think there, there's a physical shop as well, brick or mortar. But I ordered on the internet and they don't ship to Sweden, so I had it shipped to a guy in Scotland who I knew was coming here. And uh, he came last week and uh, on Sunday I got the tobacco. And the stuff I got was this. Condor, River Flag and Mello, Virginia. All uh, tobaccos I, I've tried before and uh, I really like them. I want to keep them in my uh, rotation and I can't get them here so and they're OTCs in the UK I believe and I, I think it's nice some for some reason I, I, I like smoking OTCs it's uh, I don't know I got this thing this thing about uh, pipe smoking being some sort of genuine and uh, first wasp or no sorry the first bee of the year just flew by yeah I don't know it, it feels more genuine for some reason smoking uh, Condor or Mellow Virginia that, than uh, Solani H. Burley Flake. They all taste nice, so I don't know why, why there's a difference in, in my uh, feeling regarding them. Today it's good to have a Zippo. It was for this, like this, this I got my Zippo. And uh, yeah, that was my shipment from uh, from Black Swan via Scotland. But uh, last week was St. Patrick's Day, I made a video. But I, th I don't think I mentioned that my baby sister well, she's not a baby, but she'll always be a baby to me because uh, there's uh, 21 years betwe between us. And yeah, you guessed right, we don't have the same uh, mother. But I don't count, or I don't make a difference between whole siblings and half siblings. They're uh, just the same to me. But, never mind that, uh, she went to Dublin to celebrate uh, St. Patrick's Day on, on a short holiday. And uh, yes, I was really envious of her. I've never been in Dublin, I've never been in Ireland on St. Patrick's Day. And I would, someday, I want to go there for St. Patrick's Day. But. When she was uh, there, I thought I'd ask her to uh, pop by James Fox, the tobacco shop, 
in Dublin that I went to last summer. It's a really nice shop. shop. It's expensive, but it's a, it's a really nice shop. And I was, was, asked her to go there and uh, get me two pouches of tobacco. And she got me Mick McQuaid. I won't bother to lift my butt. And uh, it's been discontinued for quite some time now. But uh, the James Fox, they've still got it. They must have filled their cellar with uh, Mick McQuaid when they learned that it was going to be discontinued. And then she got another plug for me. One that I've uh, never tried. Yachtsman uh, Navy plug. I'll show it to you. Beautiful plug. I hope I'm in focus. I can't see the screen because of the sunlight. Beautiful plug. Really hard. If I threw it at someone, I could cause real damage. And uh, when I opened the pouch, there wasn't much of a pouch note. But when I stuck my nose, now I'm messing up the fire again. When I stuck, stuck my nose to it uh, closely, it was a fantastic smell of uh, dark chocolate and raisins. And uh, the Yachtsman Navy plug consists of uh, Burley and Virginia. And I can't really, I haven't really understood if, if it's uh, natural or if it's been cased. Because in the description on uh, tobaccoreviews.com, the, the text at the very top it says it's uh, natural tobacco, but below it says that it's been cased. But the smell I I felt was uh, dark chocolate and raisins. And uh, I'm about halfway through the bowl now. And the taste I've had so far is uh, rich, chocolatey, bit of uh, earthy taste quite sweet, not too sweet, not aromatic sweet, but uh, still sweet. And I suppose that's the Virginia and Burley working together. I haven't tasted any casings, but uh, uh, my palate isn't very refined. Uh, it's a rich, heavy taste, like stout, and uh, I, I like that. that, that's my type of tobacco. And I'm glad to, get, to be able to try the Jordsman, I haven't seen anyone reviewing it on uh, YouTube. There are a couple of re reviews on tobaccoreviews.com But uh, I tried searching it on YouTube and didn't find anything And maybe it's just uh, an Irish tobacco, I don't know But as I said, I'm glad to be able to try it Yeah, I think I'll uh, stop here. 
I just want to show you what I've been restocking with uh, and I'm really happy to, to have uh, quite a lot of uh, tobacco I know I like a lot so I'm uh, looking forward to puffing my way through spring so thanks for watching take care hope to see you again bye hi again I just wanted to add uh, my impressions of uh, my first bowl of uh, Yachtsman Navy Plug and first uh, I don't think I mentioned it in the beginning but it's uh, it's a Virginia Burley blend and uh, it was a rich taste with a little chocolate in not, not uh, as much as uh, I had expected from the from the smell but still really rich and sort of yeah like having a stout and uh, the way I packed my pipe I put cubes in the bottom and the pipe by the way is a an ash pipe I made I put cubes in the bottom and higher up I tried to make the tobacco finer and I got the best taste at, at the end when I reached the cubes but right now it's it's actually a bit too rich it feels like I've uh, like I've had too much dark chocolate that kind of feeling I don't know if it's uh, if I smoked too fast or if the tobacco is too strong for me and it's not an unpleasant feeling it's just uh, the to tobacco has been great but uh, right now it feels like I've uh, had a bit too much dark chocolate. Okay, this is the final goodbye. Take care. Bye.